Today in Norfolk, a federal judge is expected to make a ruling on a lawsuit filed against Old Dominion University. A woman claims the school failed to prevent or reasonably respond to a sexual assault committed against her when she was a freshman there. She says she has gone through emotional and physical suffering because of the school's conduct. Aaron Kelly joins us live outside the Norfolk Federal Courthouse. Aaron, what exactly is expected to happen today? Well, here uh, today at the court at 12 o'clock, U.S. District Judge Henry Koch Morgan Jr. will hold a motions hearing. ODU is asking him to dismiss this woman's complaint. The woman is asking the judge to deny that request. Now, the lawsuit says that the woman was 18 years old in October 2014 when she was raped by a visitor on campus in her room at Virginia House. That's an ODU residence hall. She alleges that after she reported it, ODU police held her for eight hours and subjected her to intense questions questioning despite needing medical help. She was unable to get food, water, or use of a bathroom, according to the paperwork. Now, in court filings, the university denied that it showed an indifference to the woman's report of sexual assault and said that it immediately conducted investigation and gave no contact orders to the alleged attacker. ODU also claims the woman's complaint falls outside of the statute of limitations that she filed it too late. In a prior in a prior statement, an ODU spokesperson said, quote, Old Dominion University takes reports of sexual assault seriously. We treat students with compassion, dignity, and respect. Now, the plaintiff is asking for a jury trial and seeking $75,000 in damages, as well as some other measures, like requiring ODU, in her words, to send timely warnings to students. We'll let you know how the judge rules in today's hearing. Live in Norfolk, Erin Kelly, 10 on your side.